Hello, today inshallah we are going to study or we are going to learn how to convert how to convert mixed number into an improper fraction. But before let's revise some topics together. Now we have in here what do we call this? It's an a fraction, yes, it's a fraction. The top number of the fraction is called the numerator and the bottom number is called a denominator. So this is our fraction. What are the types of fraction? We have three types of fractions in here. First one is the proper fraction. And you can see that it's written the numerator is smaller than the denominator means you didn't finish one whole you didn't finish bar of chocolate you didn't finish your pizza you didn't get the full mark in the exam so always when you are having a proper fraction that means the numerator is less or smaller than the denominator and then the second type when we have improper fraction improper fraction that you will find it when the numerator is greater than the denominator it means now for example I have in here six halves six halves I know if I have a pizza there are only two halves in the pizza but this is this fraction represents six halves means I got more than one pizza two pizzas are enough how many halves in two pizzas <coughs> There are four halves in here, but I have six halves. That means I got more than one. Improper fraction means you have exactly one or more. So if you just finish two halves of a pizza, that means you have finished the whole pizza. This is also improper fraction. And the third type is mixed fraction. Mixed. Now, as you can see in here, we mixed a whole number with a fraction. Two and a half. That means I have two holes and a half of one. A whole number and a proper fraction. As you can see, it's a whole and a proper. Okay. How to make mixed number mad? What does it mean mad in here? These are the operations I'm going to do. M for multiplying. So I will go, if I want to, to convert this mixed and I make it improper fraction like this one. These are the steps I'm going to follow. Mad. Multiply, add, and then put the denominator multiply check how to multiply I'm multiplying the whole number by the denominator 3 by 5 is 15 this is multiplying then add 15 plus 1 is 16 this is my new numerator so M A for the numerator and then keep the denominator as it is 5 in here, so it's 5 in here. Let's check another example. I'm going to convert mixed into an improper. You have to keep repeating these expressions so you will get used, used to them. Mixed. Why it's mixed? Because I have a whole and proper fraction. How to make it improper? We will multiply the whole w in here for whole multiply the whole by the denominator 3 by 4 is 12 and go up for the numerator add it 12 and 1 it's 13 what about the denominator keep the denominator the same so we have two steps to do denominators will stay the same don't change the denominator then multiply the whole by the denominator in here as we did this one and then add the numerator another example 
I have here the mixed why it's mixed because it it contains whole and a fraction I'm mixing both together so it's mixed how to make this mixed improper fraction how to convert it into improper fraction the same multiply whole by denominator add the numerator 4 by 3 4 by 3 is 12 12 and 2 is 14 this is my new numerator okay it's easy one let's take an example if you have 5 and 3 10 what do we call this what do we call this number it's mixed why do you call it mixed because they are mixing a whole with a, an M, and a whole with a, a proper fraction yes excuse me okay now what do you want to do I want to convert this mixed into M proper M proper fraction how to do that we know we have two steps to do before I start doing the steps I will keep the same denominator I will not change the denominator so I will say it will stay the same what are the two steps multiply add multiply what by what multiply whole by denominator 5 by 10 it's 50 then take the product add it to the numerator 50 plus 3 it's 53 do another one 6 and 2 7 again what do we call this it's mixed good work mixed number why did they call it mixed number because they are mixing a whole with a proper fraction now what you want to do I want to convert it into improper fraction how to do that we have two steps to do but before I do the two steps I have to keep my denominator the same what are your two steps what are these two steps multiply add multiply what to what multiply the whole by the denominator 6 by 7 is 42 then add to 42 and 2 44 so that's how to uh, convert mixed number into improper fraction please practice so you will get fully understanding of this one thank you